Alright, next stage, next Power Ranger, Kimberly. Um, I guess she's the cheerleader to go along with the jock. I just realized that the only two people that aren't white are on the outside edges. I wonder if that's racist or not. Yep. More girl fighting. Though I do like how uh, her kick lines up perfectly with the groin area. Seriously, one knife stab is all it would take to knock any of these teenagers out. And again, they're somehow experts at... I don't want to call it martial arts because what she's doing is clearly not martial arts, but it's just fighting. By the way, this is probably one of my favorite songs from the game. I don't know why, I just... Power Rangers are too good for doorknobs. Falling chandeliers, of course. Because what level would be complete without random falling crap? Turkey! I love me a turkey leg! Curse you, crouching putties. Your ingenious methods of dodging are too much for me. Well, that's just silly. How do you use that elevator in the background if there aren't any buttons? That just makes me wonder what, what was happening to make that happen. Did the guy just get frustrated? Oh, wow. The guy got frustrated waiting on the elevator and he just went on a button-ripping out rampage. Stop jumping, you hooligans. Rapscallions. Rabble rousers. Ah, I ducked. And you couldn't hit me with your knife. And here we meet the boss for this stage, which I don't remember. I think it's... Yes, it's Genie Wolfman. What the... What the hell? Yes! I get a bow that you use as a melee weapon for some reason, but you can hold up and, sh and punch for the shooty thing. Yes, arrow, that's what it's called. Not that it's terribly useful since you're not far enough away from anything for that to actually be useful. Here we get to dodge crap. Yep. At least it's a break from all those uh, generic fight bad guys while on platform or on elevators sections of beat em ups. don't exactly know what happens if you don't grab onto that. I don't know if it waits for you to grab onto it or what, but uh, I'd much rather not find out. Also, she also went through a sex change operation. Can you kill that? Yes, 
Okay. Okay. Oh, that's not even fair. My arrows, of course, go over any enemies. I have to say, I do enjoy this stage compared to the other ones. It's a bit more platforming oriented, and personally, I prefer platformers. Also, you can knock people into the endless abyss. And by endless abyss, I mean uh, a building. Then again, if you fall in there, you die. Whoa, what? I'm sure there are some safety standards being broken here. Besides, those are very small girders. Oh, puzzle time. How do you get that? You just hold down and jump. When I first played this, I had no idea how to get those. Um, I also used to think that these were wearing wigs. Don't ask me why, but I just, I enjoyed the idea of a sentry gun that had a wig. No, I don't have a fetish for sentry guns. I don't remember this. Oh. Oh, this, this is going to be annoying. Really? So how do I kill this? Do you just wait to trick it into coming out? This isn't even fair. I don't know. Is this just here to waste a bomb? Is that was okay? Well, here you go. I think that that's lasers. Maybe I don't know. Yeah, I think that was just there to waste your bomb, so you don't use it on this guy. I'm pretty sure he teleports too. Uh, here we. Uh, we go from playing Power Rangers to playing a Toho game. He throws mirrors. Oh, the mirrors shoot lasers, of course. Everything in this game has to shoot lasers. I'm sure that if there were just lasers, they would shoot lasers. He also shoots fireballs that shoot lasers when they hit the ground. Laser dragons. Laser knives. As soon as that finger points, it's all over. Ah, uh, he dances around some and catches on fire. And that is the end of Genie Wolfman. Nineteen seventy. That sure was a year. So um, with that, this video is concluded. I will see you in the next video.